Jamie, thank you. 531 is your time right now. We do want to get back to our top three stories of the morning. First, we are monitoring the search for the suspect in yesterday's shooting on a New York City subway train and the abrupt termination of the Volusia County Superintendent. But first, we do want to begin with that attempted kidnapping suspect's expected appearance in an Orange County courtroom today. Nguyen, who you see here, was booked into jail yesterday. Deputies say he tried to kidnap a child on Monday. That child was on his way to school. Fox 35's Nestor Model joins us live now from outside of the jail this morning. And deputies are now worried that when may have interacted with more children. That's right, Danielle. This was the story everybody was talking about yesterday. In fact, a parent actually called deputies saying that she recognized the man that he had approached a 13 year old last year. So because of that, investigators are worried that he may have had contact with other children. But right now he's off the streets in jail and awaiting his first appearance today at one in the afternoon. I do want to show you video of him being hauled away in handcuffs. This is 37 year old Vin Wynn. He's charged with luring a child, false imprisonment and battery. Deputies say that the man, he's the one on video approaching a child Monday morning. The little boy actually told investigators that he grabbed his cheeks, put his arm around him, told him he was cute, asked him if he wanted a ride to school. And in fact, detectives even say that Wynn also tried grabbing the child's behind. Of course, the boy was able to get away and tell school officials what happened. Nearby Azalea Park Elementary alerted parents. We talked about it this morning because they, they watched the video too. I showed it to them and we talked about it. You never talk to a stranger. Nobody ever puts their hands on you. Well, a lot of parents are using this video, this instance, to go ahead and teach their kids about stranger danger. In fact, deputies say that it was a concerned citizen who actually called and tipped them off about when, when reportedly told deputies that had the boy got in his car, all he would have done is take him to school. I'm live in Orange County. That's Romato, Fox 35 News. 